Did you have a very dirty game that doesn't boot up on your DS system? Let's fix it. We only need a few supplies here. Uh, isopropyl alcohol, this is 91%. Um, pretty cheap, less than five bucks at Walmart. Maybe not the specific brand, but just in general. A security bit or a very small flathead. This will work. Um, you can also use a needle, whatever will work. Well, those will work, those will work best. The whole point is to get between the pins here to scratch it off um, to get out the dirt and gunk and whatever. Plus, it doesn't break the side like cartridge pin here to, um, yeah, that's the whole point for that. And also, paper towel. Basically, we're going to we're gonna pour the alcohol on here and... You'll see in a moment. Basically, you tear this paper towel, make it a size to the point that's small enough for the DS cartridge, and can basically fit it. And then we're gonna pour alcohol on top of here, and we're gonna get scrubbing. Just to show you don't have to get a ton on here, basically, this will work. And let's get to it. So fold the piece a couple times. You're gonna put them on the edge here where the pins are. Basically the whole point is scratching these, well, taking it and moving it up and down to get the dirt off. You don't wanna do it bare because you don't wanna scratch the pins. It probably will still work, but this is more, this cleans the pins plus it doesn't damage your cartridge. And also, if your cartridge has numbers here, just be, well, your, I think it's identification code. Be very careful when you do it because the alcohol will wipe the stuff away. Um, the first few times you do this, you're probably still going to scratch a little bit, but this is, this is a great way to do it. There are other ways you could fold a piece of paper. Um... Yeah, full piece of computer paper and scratch it out. But this is, to me, this is my favorite way of doing it. It will take a few times depending on the condition of what it is. I mean, well, of what your pins are. And I think this is great too because, like I said, you don't um, split the side pins. I mean, the side, yeah. As mentioned, it varies. It's got to vary how much dirt and grime is on there. Or what is it exactly? It could be corrosion. You could still get this off with this. It's not going to be perfect, but obviously the whole point is to get your game to work. And it does, it does look better. It's not great. But it does look better than what it was. Let's just keep going at it. This is obviously the other um, dirt and grime that's on the other side. I just fold it again to do it. To scratch it again. There are other ways, such as opening up the cartridge. Um, I don't exactly, well, I haven't exactly done that yet. Um, at your own risk for that one. <laughs> but there are videos on YouTube for that. And this is what it looks like after more scrubbing. Definitely looks a lot better. Uh, definitely depends on how far you want to go. Uh, I'm going to sco stop right here. Let's see if it works. Oh, 
All right. Let's see what boots up. That's great. Great. And there you have it. That is the way that I do it. Um, it's basically just, it's very easy. Um, it might not come out perfect. Like, as you can see here, there are, there are some grind, but the game does work. It really does depend on how far you want to go. There are other ways like opening up the cartridge. You could take brass out to the pins and such, but me, I just do it like this and it does work. All right. Thanks for watching.